future. Yeah, yeah, we get it, Ann. Oh, man, she's been trying to make me forget about finding my human body, so I'll just live life in a row. But I got a good feeling, man. I'm staying positive. Engaging door lock. Please wait. Oh, dang, is that... Is that my hand? Well, who else's hand would it be, dummy? Fair point, man. I'm just not mentally prepared to accept the possibility that something really bad has happened to my childless dad bod. My scans indicate several more organic anomalies. Oh, come on, are you serious? My body's in a bunch of pieces? Oh, man, how are we gonna find them all? With transference, you will gain the ability to detect such anomalies yourself. Done and done. Here and now, another promise is made. We will find my body parts and put me back together like Humpty Dumpty, because there ain't no point in saving a world that does not include my beautiful booty. I'm happy you will comply. Transference is the future. Okay, just like Ann said, we need to find the space jets I was using. Can't get to the transference center without them. Watch your step, man, and remember, the sand is bad. Damn! Looks like the energy cores are up there. We need to find those space jets. Where's my junk? Nick! Nick! Where's my junk? Nick! You are lucky you've never had to go through this, man. Nick, I'm telling you, there is no worse feeling than thinking you found your dismembered member only to realize it's your peckerless pelvis? Come on, man! A little sympathy.
We gotta find the rest of me, Nick. From my temples to my taint to my toes, man. All of me, okay? And then Anne can turn me into... The real boy. Her... What you're saying is impossible. No way, Jose. You shoot a big enough load of that space jizz in the Ant 3D printer and anything is possible. Nonsense, Herc. With transference, you'll become something greater than man. You will become immortal. Indestructible. You will be... perfect. While there is truth to that statement, I gotta be honest with you, I am on the temporary train for this one, Anne. I don't expect you to understand the joys of humanity. The pleasures of the flesh, the delights of the senses, the takings of a monstrous dumb. Come on, man. Do you want me to be a cyber killing machine and fulfill my destiny or not? Controlling my emotions, man. It is the only thing I have left. Now let's get to the transference center. Get it. You're afraid if I become a robot, I'll try to kill you, but I promise I won't. I'm gonna be a good robot, like RTD2, but with a machine gun. Approaching transference center. Oh man, I'm starting to get real excited now. I cannot believe that in just a few minutes, I'm gonna be a cold, uncaring, cybernetic death monster. It's gonna be sweet, man. It's gonna be sweet. Okay, the terminal is on the top floor. You gotta power that place up before we can use the transference chamber. You fly like the wind now, little monkey. Monkeys don't fly, hurt. Not with that attitude, they don't.
Conference Center restored. You can now use... The two of you working as a team will greatly increase our chances of success. Team Tad Bros for life! Put me in, dude! Put me in! I know, I'd recognize that ugly face anywhere. You're the reason my wiener's rolling around the sand somewhere looking like a gigantic breaded chicken cutlet. Put me in for real, and don't forget to take my head. We'll need it to complete the awkward human puzzle I've become. Channel now! Don't mess up my goatee. some theme music. energy core. Let's head to the closest antenna.
I need help here, man! I'm hurt! All right, buddy. Brace yourself. You're about to pop a bro-boner here. Check it out. Your bad boy Robocop here is fitted with a whole punch of lasers that these spacecraft don't stand no chance against. And this sexy, delicious, rock-hard body was built to last all kinds of physical and verbal abuse. We're linked up, man, so you can just tell me where to go and I'll follow, man. I won't even argue like ever. Unless you say something about monkeys. And if we find ourselves in a pickle and shit gets real intense, you just use me, man. I'll draw these suckers away with my jaw-dropping dance moves and such. Now, I know you're impressed with how impressive I've become, but don't let how impressive I am distract you from the fact that we gotta give our human compadres the heroes they deserve. We need to find more energy cores, man. I think there's another antenna nearby, so let's go. Herc, just how the hell did you get mixed up in all this? Man, that's not important. What is important is that you understand how much danger we're all in because I didn't, okay? I fucked up. I, I, I didn't really realize. I tried to impress Anne by taking care of this all myself and where to get me? Got my damn body snatched and sprinkled all over damn Mars. It's probably my fault for telling her that I was Earth's greatest champion. I see that now, but come on, man. I was, I was trying to get some. So all I'm trying to tell you, Nick, is that you can't be a dummy about this, okay? You can't be thinking you're some new hot kid on the block. You gotta stay humble, man. Stay focused. You gotta be smart, man, like old Herky. Do you hear yourself? I'm stuck doing this because you're not smart. You're actually really, really dumb, Herc. I was dumb, Nick. I was dumb. Past tense. And for like a very short period of time, I'm talking 17 seconds max. And that's way less time than most people spend being dumb, which is a scientific fact. Which means that it is scientifically impossible for me to do anything dumb for like a long, long time, man. Like statistically, that's a fact. Right? 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 Nick? Ah. <sighs> 